Ladies and gentlemen, as you all know, my name is PK and this is PK Web Studio. This is our first episode of VFX of the Week. Now, VFX of the Week is meant to bring you various VFX from major giant media houses that are doing so well and are bringing us amazing VFX where you can learn and also become a master of the arts. So today is our first episode of VFX of the Week which we are going to bring you amazing and wonderful videos where you can also copy and add them to your work and become a master of the work. UK works, as you all know, I work. And you need to subscribe to the channel because I'm going to bring you amazing VFX. Hello guys, with most of us wanting to use Element 3D, Adobe has come out with some issues concerning Element 3D, where anyone who wants to use Element 3D can just watch this video and know how your computer or your PC is like before you use Element 3D. Now, I get a lot of complaints with people coming to me, even on my Telegram, asking me to help them with their Element 3D problems. Guys, some computers cannot use Element 3D. Before you can use an Element 3D software, you need to have a graphic card on your computer. With the Adobe new updates, Concerning After Effects, without a graphic card, you cannot use Element 3D. Now, these are some of the tips that Adobe brought when it comes to Element 3D. Let's read through so that we can uh, go through and know what we are supposed to do when we want to use Element 3D. So, how to avoid crashes with Adobe Video Copilot Element 3D. This was updated on May 24th, 2023. So issues, avoiding crashes and caching problems with a video copilot Element 3D. Solution one, install the most recent update for Element 3D and After Effects to avoid crashes and caching problems. So if you have installed the most recent update of Element 3D and After Effects, crashes do not occur. Install update and, a file, and file a bug report if you continue to have problems. So they're telling you that to avoid all crashes in After Effects concerning Element 3D, you need to use the latest version of After Effects and the latest version of Element 3D. Now, also, you have to know this. Some of us don't have good computers. So definitely, if you store Element 3D, it's not going to work. So now let's go to solution two. Now, solution two. Solution two says, Check GPU compatibility, current settings, and scene complexity. Now, Video Copilot indicates that users having trouble with Element 3D are running it with higher settings higher than their card. It's capable of or with overlay complex scenes. Video Copilot recommends these suggestions for avoiding such problems. Also, make sure that your computer meets the specific the specification, sorry, for Element 3D. See additional troubleshooting information from Video Copilot. So when you click on that link, it's going to take you straight to Video Copilot and Video Copilot is going to help you if indeed you have a graphic card or you don't have a graphic card, which I'm going to show to you next on the screen. Okay, so please let us check if we have a graphic, graphic card or not because Video Copilot is a 3D software which requires a graphic card. So if you don't have a graphic card, then please, you cannot use Element 3D. Let's go to Solution 3. So with solution three, you're going to be given, um, when you click on the link, you just go to the end video copilot page. Now, when you go to the page, you are going to be given the NVIDIA or AMD graphic card update. If your graphic card needs an update, they are going to help you. Okay. And then they're going to ask you if your graphic card is indeed compatible with element 3d or no, please note element 3d is a 3d software that requires a graphic card without a graphic card your PC will not work with Element 3D. So guys, this is the end of the video. Try to get a PC with a graphic card. If you have a PC with a graphic card, to try to update your graphic card and then visit this page and have a final update. Thank you very much for watching. The name is PK Works, and as you know, I work. Please subscribe to the channel. See you the next time.